hello everybody, it's Sergey again. Uh, I came back from my own vacation, back to Russia and I advise you to go to Russia. So today my mission is explain to you that there is a winter period when everything is gray and cold everywhere in the world except like southern part but we don't talk about them anymore. It's boring, nothing to do. Hello now. This is the page which we're gonna call and in Ismailova there is a very beautiful place which is basically a Kremlin. Don't mess with the Kremlin. Kremlin, Kremlin. K -k okay. This place is a fairy tale in the modern city. The Zmailovsky Kremlin is just like the Red Square, but a little different. The more historical and of course more specific. Comparing to Red Square, the smile of a Kremlin is more colorful. And it's almost on the outside line of Moscow. So let's find out why every tourist must come here. Hey there, so today we're at the Ismailovsky Kremlin and if you're thinking with, uh, we invented time machine, then we don't, we don't even do it, but the Kremlin is just for a tourist, for us, free to enter and not just only beautiful place to go, but it also can give you the sense of atmosphere of the, you know, of the ancient uh, Moscow and ancient type of living. There is an ancient legend that there was a man who was living for centuries. He'd been fighting in many wars, he was not able to die. He came back from every war and decided to build a home where there will be peace and quiet for him and the people he loved. And him, then, he goes to Russia and started to build all this with his own claws. The name of this man is Logan. Thank you, Wolverine. Thank you. Nice job. This is Go to Russia. And we're going back. here is very big and there is a lot of interesting places to, to stop to visit to have a meal and people smiling here and the atmosphere it's like let's have a party it's like a, like a new year or Christmas every day here and here you can see a lot of museums uh, they are all of them inside mostly with English language of course as well and uh, all of them is somehow connected to the type of living like uh, centuries ago so for example Iron Museum, you know iron, or bread museum, or, or anything else, but which people are doing with their hands, you know. So it's basically the, you know, like a, I don't know, museum of the people been doing years ago. Uh, yeah, this is a matryoshka, you know, this thing. Usually, it's a it's tr traditional Russian doll. We like open it, and there's another. Keep on going. You can take a photo in here, and uh, over there, there is a. Baba Yaga's house. <laughs> if legends are true legends, uh, then Baba Yaga can turn herself into a cat. And, you know, be so adorable, and everybody wanted to say, it, like, you know, oh, kitty, 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 and then she go away. You're running after her to her house. Then you meet another type of uh, Baba Yaga, like this with a bunch of pancakes, with candies and everything sweet. So the kids like, oh my God, oh my God. And then she did not become not like beautiful cat or beautiful woman anymore. She become like scary, get your kid and put them into the oven. And cooking. <laughs> cooking. Yeah, so that's why it's a scary story because cats, and pancakes and everything is good but in the end you become a food just so be careful you know just be careful with the old grandmas with pancakes and with the cats yeah. can you please a little quiet we're trying to record a video here um thank you two minutes two minutes we'll talk our uh, yeah two minutes so i ask a guy to stop this ringing and if you're going here take some you know tea and some food because there is a lot of place 
for you to have a, a, a light meal and it'll be interesting. Of course, there's cafes and everything, but you know, always it's better to have something in the pocket than, you know, to uh, not to have anything like buy cat. Break. Семидовуха горячая, да? Пол литрочка, пожалуйста. Она не сильно крепкая, то что. Today it's a little bit cold, and as I was saying a lot of times, I'm very, you know, uh, unsustainable to freezing. Uh, so here we can buy some hot, hot honey with beer. So basically, it's uh, midavucha honey beer. You can see here. It's, it's very good for your health. It's good for you know warm up, and it's good for hangover. So thank you, thank you a lot. Mm, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Stop. You know, like we want to, we want to buy the thing. My is all happy. Get some honey beer. Mm, feel myself alive again. Yeah, baby, yeah! It's winter, you got nothing to do, it's cold on the street, where to go, where to go. You come to Ismailovsky Kremlin, you feel right away like you're in ancient Russia and the sense of cold, the winter, it brings you, you know, the feeling of like celebration of New Year or something and there is like different games, different drinks and you can walk, step inside of the museum, drink something, eat something, talk about something with somebody and it's very, very beautiful and sometimes you cannot see modern structures at all. So you just, you know, find yourself like, oh, for 10 minutes, the only thing I'm seeing is just, you know, this ancient buildings made of wood and it's, you know, sometimes I'm even forget that I have a cell phone in my pocket, if you know what I mean. And it's like brilliant. Thank you. Thank you, Logan. <laughs> for building this place, because, <laughs> you know, me, I'm tired of cell phones. Everybody is, you know, Snapchatting, doing something, sending something here. You can forget about this. Of course, after you made a thousands of photos for Instagram. Yeah. Russian Hollywood. Castle on the island. This is kind of a place where you can see how the Russian kings was living. Or at least they was shown like.
Hello, 911. This is an emergency. Yeah, you have to uh, subscribe our channel. Okay, now uh, now press the like button. Yeah. Okay, uh, I done and uh, yeah, and see you on the next show.